So you're a man who has everything. And nothing. Truth is, I am Iron Man. I am Iron Man. You think you're the only superhero in the world? Mr. Stark, you become part of a bigger universe. You just don't know it yet. I don't know where you're getting your information. What do you remember about your dad, huh? He was cold, he was calculating. He never told me he loved me, he never even told me he liked me. So it's a little tough for me to digest when you're telling me he said the whole future was riding on me and he's passing it down. I don't get that. Yeah, big man in a suit of armor. Take that off, what are you? The only thing you really fight for is yourself. You're not the guy to make the sacrifice play, to lay down on a wire and let the other guy crawl over you. You know, you may not be a threat, but you better stop pretending to be a hero. I, 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 I'm just not the, the hero type, clearly. With this uh, laundry list of character defects, all the mistakes I've made, largely public. Sorry. I'm a piping hot mess. Nothing's been the same since New York. You experience things, and then they're over, and you still can't explain them. Gods, aliens, other dimensions. I'm, I'm just a man in a can. Threat is imminent, and I have to protect the one thing that I can't live without. I love you, Fleet Housing. That's you. And my suits, they're, uh, artificial intelligence. They're ashamed. They're part of me. <sighs> this could be it, Chris. This could be the key to creating Ultron. What if next time aliens roll up to the club, and they will? What if the world was safe? Every time someone tries to win a war before it starts, innocent people die. Every time. Isn't that the mission? Isn't that the why we fight? So we can end the fight? So we get to go home? Don't waste it. Don't waste your lives. You're gonna kill yourself, Tony. I see a suit of armor around the world. I'm not crazy, Pepper. I just finally know what I have to do. Sounds like a cold world, huh? I've seen colder. I shouldn't be alive. Unless it was for a reason. The only people threatening the planet would be people. I don't think you quite understand what's at stake no. here. It's you who doesn't understand that Thanos has been inside my head for six years since he sent an army to New York and now he's back. And I don't know what to do. We're the Avengers. That up there, that's... That's the end game. How are you guys planning on beating them? Together. We'll lose. And we'll do that together, too. I don't want to go. I don't want to go. Sir, please. Please, I don't want to go. I don't want to go. Lost again. Tony, we lost. Spare his life. And I will give you the stone. And I'm the man who killed the Avengers. Whole world too. Because of me. No, I can't help everybody. It sort of seems like you can. Not if I stop. I can put a pin in it right now and stop. But would you be able to rest? What you just saw. That is your legacy, Star. Is that how you want to go out? Is this the last act of defiance of the great Tony Stark? Or are you going to do something about it? Is this the first time you lost a soldier? We are not soldiers. Sorry. Tony, if someone dies on your watch, you don't give up. Who said we're giving up? I, I believe I remember telling 
Oh, tell me. yes. Tell me. Tell me. Alive and otherwise, that what we needed was a pseudo armor around the world. Remember that? Whether it impacted our precious freedoms or not, that's what we needed. Well, that didn't work out, did it? I said we'd lose. You said we'll do that together too. And guess what, Cap? We lost. And you weren't there. Tony, the Avengers are yours, maybe more so than mine. I know I hurt you, Tony. I guess I thought, yes, by not telling you about your parents, I was sparing you, but I can see now that I was really sparing myself, and I'm sorry. Hopefully one day you can understand. Couldn't stop you. Neither could I. There was an idea. The idea was to bring together a group of remarkable people. See if they could become something more. See if they could work together when we needed them to. To fight the battles that we never could. You yeah, have my respects, Doc. When I'm done, half of humanity will still be alive. Not that that matters in the least to you. You think you fight for us? You just fight for yourself. I know what it's like to lose. You feel so desperately that you're right. Yet to fail, nonetheless. Tony. We have to take a stand. We did stand, and yet here we are. I got my second chance right here, Cap. Bring back what we lost, I hope, yes. Keep what I found, I have to, at all costs. We will. Whatever it takes. Whatever it takes. Whatever it takes. Whatever it takes. You could not live with your own failure. Where did that bring you? Back to me. I thought by eliminating half of life, the other half would thrive. But you've shown me that's impossible. You're missing the point. There's no throne. There is no version of this where you come out on top. Maybe your army comes, and maybe it's too much for us, but it's all on you. But the work is done. So if we can't protect the Earth, you can be damn well sure we'll avenge it. It always will be. I am inevitable. And so, my journey had reached its end. God, it seems like a thousand years ago. I fought my way out of that cave, became Iron Man, realized I loved you. Tony, look at me. We're gonna be okay. Peace in our time. Imagine that. You can rest now. I love you 3,000. Part of the journey is the end. <laughs>